हे गाइज हाउ आर यू आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग गुड एंड वेलकम बैक टू अनदर वीडियो टुडे इन दिस वीडियो आई एम बैक विद अनदर अमेजिंग कस्टम रूम फॉर आवर रेडमी नोट एट एंड नोट एट टी सो टुडे वी हैव द पिक्सल ब्लास्टर ओ एस विच इज़ द बूस्टेड वर्जन ऑफ पिक्सल एक्सपीरियंस रोम्स एंड दिस रोम इज प्रिटी मच इंटरेस्टिंग सो मेक श्योर यू वाई दैट फुल वीडियो so without any further ado let's get started today in this video i will review it out and i will also show you how you can install it on your redmi note 8 and note 8t so let's get started so first of all let me show you its android version which is the android 11 as you can see here the pixel blaster os is 3.0 and its android version is latest uh, because uh, android 12 is not stable yet so for for now the android 11 is latest and uh, its security patch is also latest which is the 5 september 2021 and uh, i hope you can uh, see it clearly and the rom is pretty much awesome uh, like this is not uh, like other pixel experience and pixel extended roms this is pretty much different as you can see here uh, the ui and the user experience is pretty much clean uh, we don't have a lot of janky application we only have some necessary applications like we also have the miui camera pre installed in this rom and uh, some important applications are installed and if you need more applications then you can uh, download from the play store and you can also google them so the overall experience and smoothness of this rom is brilliant like i have not faced any issue any lag while uh, playing any game and uh, doing any multitasking the rom is pretty stable there is no any single bug or issue in this rom everything is just working properly in the quick settings we have a lot of shortcuts right here as you can see here you can edit them by clicking on this edit button so you can drag and drop any tool if you want to add or remove so here we have the clock at the top which looks pretty much awesome then we have the button slider automatic button and some other uh buttons right here and uh, if we go into the recent applications we have some android 12 and android 11 advanced features like you can screenshot the uh, last preview of any application like of this camera you can screenshot it and you can also uh, edit it and send it to anyone or share it then we have the select option like you have some text on any application and you want to copy it up or select it up just go to recent click on select and tap on the uh, text and it will be automatically identified you can uh, copy the text share the text and you can also search this text now let's dig into the settings in the settings we have pretty much clean ui of this setting as you can see here uh, it pretty much uh, looks like the one ui from samsung Uh, at the top we have the search bar then we have settings right here and uh, it it is pretty much smoother right now so here we have network and internet connected devices at uh, display in the display uh, we have brightness level night light which is working fine you can change its intensity and adaptive brightness styles and wallpapers in the styles and wallpaper we only have one style you can create your own by clicking on the custom button you can pick up some wallpapers we only have one wallpaper pre installed but don't worry you can download a lot of wallpapers from google and uh, then we have styles you can change the grid of your uh, home screen and lounge chair then you can choose the clock for your lock screen let's choose this one click on apply and as you can see here it looks pretty much awesome so after it we have screen time out auto rotation colors you can change the color profile but it doesn't 
effect anything then you can change the font style font size display size uh, screen saver lock screen uh, settings uh, from here you can also enable the always on display and it works properly but it gonna drain your battery quickly so it's not recommended then you can enable tap to wake you can manage the display cutout and you can also enable the blur then we have explosives in the explosives we have some uh, advanced customization options first of all we have the themes from here you can enable the dark theme which looks pretty much awesome but i will go with this light theme then you can change the cloak style you can change this theme overlays you can manage the uh, volume style as you can see here it looks pretty much awesome and it has uh, a wide range of volume styles like you can choose the MIUI or oxygen os and a lot of uh, cloak styles are available right here as you can see here then you can manage the custom header and you can also enable the wallpaper based accent then we have status bar settings from here you can manage the status bar uh, icons and other settings and you can also enable the traffic indicator sorry for the camera shake and then we have quick settings then we have button settings notifications lock screen settings like from here you can enable double tap to sleep and double tap to uh, wake and other settings then we have misc in the misc we have adaptive playback like settings and gaming mode uh, of course this is the advanced gaming mode as you can see here then we have fod customization but it don't really works i don't know why then we have sound the sound quality of this room is pretty much awesome because we have the sound enhancer then we have apps and notifications battery the battery backup of this room is really amazing even on this stock kernel from here you can enable the battery saver you can enable or disable the battery percentage and then we have storage privacy location security now in the security we have all security options like we have all the uh, screen locks and uh, plus uh, fingerprint is working face unlock is working plus the most important thing app locker is present in this rom you can set it up and use it no need to install and download and install and set up the third party app lockers so then we have accessibility accounts digital well-being google system in the system we have languages and input gestures in the gesture we have quickly open camera system navigation bar you can really hide the navigation bar pill right from here but i am using it because i like it and then we have uh, prevent ringing swipe three fingers to screenshot quick touch power menu from the power menu you can enable the advanced reboot as you can see here it's gonna really help you out and then we have date and time status bar tuner from here you can uh, manage the status bar icons then we have backup rules reset option multiple user updater and uh, because this is this room is official so you can use this updater uh, if any uh, update is coming and you can simply update your room from right here then we have the xiaomi parts in the xiaomi part we have some me sound enhancer which will be helpful to enhance the sounding quality then we have lcd features display color collaboration xiaomi doors which is the ambient display and you can also enable the usb fast charge so this is a really good feature so uh, then we have about phone from the about phone you can check your android version which is the android 11 the android security patches latest 5 september 2021 pixel blaster version is 3.0 which is the official and stable so the rom is pretty stable there is no any single bug or issue in this rom you can use it as your daily driver and if you want to use it as your daily driver or you want to test it out just download the rom from the link in the description and uh, store it into your android phone 
then reboot your device into an installed custom recovery I am using the uh, TWRP recovery so if you have not installed uh, recovery yet then watch my previous videos after going into the recovery uh, first we need to wipe the old ROM just go into the wipe click on advanced wipe and from here you have to select uh, all the options except the internal storage SD card so wipe right from here after wiping go back to home go to install now locate your downloaded or copied pixel blaster 3.0 ginkgo rom just click on it and flash it right from here after flashing it you can also flash the magic if you want to root and uh, then click on reboot click on system and after a few seconds the rom will be booted up on your redmi note 8 so hope you guys like this video if you really did hit the like button don't forget to subscribe my channel keep supporting thanks for watching peace